shot that may illustrate just how dangerous conditions are. A tractor trailer crashed our fruit too in Westminster. It was carrying hundreds of bottles of vitamin water. The Westminster Fire Department posted a message on Facebook warning drivers to beware those slippery roads. In Tewksbury tonight, cleaning up meant removing a pine tree from inside a kitchen. The wind knocking it into and through the roof. The storm actually knocked down a lot of trees out there. WBZ's Michael Cross is live in Tewksbury with more on this. Mike? David, the pine tree was in the backyard. It came crashing down onto the roof here. Take a look. You can see what remains of it here tonight. And as you mentioned, that wasn't the only tree causing problems tonight. Crews working into the night, removing the tree that came crashing down on this home on Pratt Street this morning. I mean, the boom, it was, I didn't know what it was. It scared the daylights out of me. The Tewksbury Fire Department says the guy inside sleeping wasn't hurt and is staying somewhere else tonight because of the extensive damage. The tree was hanging down on the Jeep right over here, so the door got damaged. In nearby Andover, Sean Page shows us what a maple tree did to his colonial. 4 a.m. sharp it was, and boom, thing came down. It was like a big crash, felt like an earthquake, and uh, we knew right away what it was. Looked out the door, fortunately it didn't come through the roof, and you know, we escaped the tragic. Home's not the only thing taking a hit from trees. Check out this trapped truck on Blue Hill Ave in Milton. Fire officials saying the driver got out okay. On the Situate Coast, water causing the problems as waves came crashing over the new seawall, flooding the streets. We're glad to be on high grounds. They, they tell us that we don't flood at least very often. And tonight, what's left of the nor'easter is creating concerns of freezing roads. You know, you take the winters with the summers, I guess. And back out live, you can see just how massive this tree is. Now, we talked to the crews that took this off of this house, and they say it's a good idea to have an expert check out a tree in your own yard to see if it's decaying or could be an issue. Reporting live in Tuxbury tonight, Mike LaCrosse, WVZ News. Mike, thank you.